Welcome to this tutorial on object tracking. Using object tracking feature in Superimpose V, you can move a layer, along with the movement of another object in a video. I have this video clip loaded from Pexels in the Superimpose V app. And I am going to track one of the cars, in this video. Let me first add a shape layer on a new track. And then, add some shapes on it. First let me add some text. Let me call this label, my car. This is not really my car though. And then I am going to add an arrow. And then do some adjustments to the arrow, so that it points towards the car. Now we have a text nicely pointing towards the car, but when we play the video, they all go out of sync. This is where the tracking feature comes handy. To track an object, first you need to select the layer that you want to move, along with an object in the video. And in this case, we need to select the shape layer, as this is the layer that needs to move. And then, tap on this little track option below. This brings up the tracking panel, where we can do the tracking. First we need to select the object that we want to track. And we do that, by fitting it inside this green box. We can also adjust the size of the green box, to make the object fit properly. Also, it is important to be at the beginning of the video track, because the tracking will start only from where the playhead is. And once everything is ready, just tap on the start tracking button, and the app will track the object for you. And now the green box has turned into orange, which means the object has already been tracked. Now, if you move the timeline, you can see that it is following the car we selected. And along with the box, the shape layer also follows the object. And now with tracking applied, let me play the video. Just as I expected, the text is moving nicely with the car. I hope you will find this feature useful. Thank you.